We were intrigued when Honda introduced its Grom for the 2014 model year, as the little 125cc street legal play bike looked to be a fun and accessible way to ride a motorbike around town. It proved to be one of Honda's best sellers in its street lineup. It was lightly updated for 2016, which inspired a ridiculously fun shootout between new competitors from Kawasaki, Z125, Kimco, k Hype 125, and the SSR Rascal. Now Benny is joining the fray with the introduction of the TNT 135 to the American market, boasting a 135cc fuel-injected motor claiming 13 horsepower when rated at its crankshaft. That should translate into more than 10 horsepower at the rear wheel, which would handily trump the 125cc Grom's best in class 8.3 RWHP. The little TNT's curve appeal might also lead the class, with sharp overall styling augmented by an attractive trellis frame and awesomely cool double exit high pipes reminiscent of an MV Augusta. Fitting the playback theme, the TNT rides on 12-inch wheels and uses disc brakes at each end. About the only negative aspect to the TNT 135 might be its weight. Benny claims it scales in at 267 pounds which compares unfavorably to the Grom's fully fueled 231 pounds. As it is manufactured in China by Bendy's parent company, Kianjian, we expect it to be competitively priced.